Good Tuesday morning. So I'm sitting here in the lobby at Mayo, just kind of killing some time. I was here before seven o'clock this morning to have a blood draw. And then after that, I went and had an EMG. I was supposed to also have a, uh, an MRI this morning, but that got canceled. Um, they decided that that particular MRI, what they were looking for, didn't need to uh, didn't need to have it. So um, blood draw went went really well, really quick. It's uh, it's amazing how efficient everything here is. When I got to the place where I had to have the blood draw, there were probably 50 or 60 people sitting there, and they just call people. Right out front for Julie. Julie, you're right here. <laughs> they just call people left and right <clears throat> to come in and get their blood drawn and even though it's quick and there are so many people there the people who work here everybody's just so incredibly friendly and kind and just really give you personal attention you don't feel like you're you know in a cattle call at all so um, no problems getting the blood drawn and then I went over and had the EMG and <clears throat> if you've ever, uh, never had an EMG there there were pretty uncomfortable they they zap you with electricity to see how your muscles react they stick needles that are similar to um, like acupuncture needles in your in your legs and you have to contract and and squeeze your muscles and they record the electrical activity in the muscles it's it's pretty it's pretty unpleasant um, but what was interesting is I talked to the girl who did my uh, the first part of my EMG this morning and I told her that my previous EMG four years ago was definitely not pleasant and she said have you ever had one here and I said no and <clears throat> she said well technique really matters and the she said they do more EMG tests here in a day than most places do in six months um, the doctor who did the needle part told me that um, they do a hundred or more of these a day here and I gotta tell you they're right because while it was unpleasant it was nothing at all like the one I had done four years ago it was um, they were they were much more gentle and very thoughtful about how how I was going to feel during the during the test so really really appreciate that and so but I did get a little bit of a scare this morning because after the after the test the EMG the doctor who did the EMG said uh, that he talked to Dr. Mauerman and she said don't go home and I said you mean don't go home like back to my hotel or don't go home back to Chicago and he said back to Chicago and I was like oh because I'm booked on a flight tonight <laughs> So, long story short, I checked, and she just really meant stick around for a little bit, um, wait until she gets the EMG test results to make sure that they don't show anything um, really off. She didn't want me to leave without having those results in. So, I'm just kind of sitting around here waiting to see if I get any results. I figure in about another 15 or 20 minutes, if I don't hear anything, I'll go back and hang out at the hotel for a while rather than just sit here. But that's my update Melissa, for today. So, it's really cool, like they call for different different rides that are out front. So, anyways, that's my update this morning. And I'm going to call it quits. I'll give you guys an update again after I get some results. Have a good